a picture-perfect family. <laughs> Bob McDonald enjoys playing with his 10-year-old son, Mark. But shortly after Mark was born, his parents noticed something wrong. He didn't start to walk till he was a bit older, closer to 18 months, and that's always a red flag. Doctors diagnosed Mark with Duchenne muscular dystrophy, the most common form of the disease, which primarily affects boys. It was the, the darkest day of all of our lives. Over time, it destroys muscles, and people with Duchenne rarely live past age 30. This dog could be living proof that a breakthrough treatment is just around the corner. Like humans, dogs can develop the disease. A team of researchers at the University of Missouri has successfully treated dogs with Duchenne. To treat this disease, you have to deliver your therapeutic gene to every muscle in the body. And that is a gigantic task. Duchenne muscular dystrophy occurs when a gene mutation disrupts the production of a protein known as dystrophin. Without this protein, boys like Mark lose muscle function. The University of Missouri School of Medicine research team created a micro version of this gene and use a common virus to deliver the therapy to every muscle in the body. After more than a decade of research, Dewan says clinical trials in humans are the next step. The results are just extremely, extremely promising. And this is something, I, I mean, I've been dreaming for years and finally seeing that come true. With gene therapy, children with Duchenne muscular dystrophy may be able to live a happier and longer life. You have to have not just hope, but you have to have optimism. And Dr. Duan gives us that. From the University of Missouri, I'm Kent Faddis reporting. <laughs>